It's Thursday, and you know what that means, don't you? We're going over to see our awesome friend, Kimmy's Kitchen and More. Oh yeah, she is an awesome channel and always comes up with something interesting for us to see. And today is one of our favorite things to join in with. You know what that is, don't you? We are joining in new to me. Oh yeah. Let's go see what Grandma picked up, but don't forget to go over and see Kimmy and give her a little bit of love and let her know that Grandma Sandy sent you. Also, please check out the playlist. There's a lot of wonderful creators that join in with New To Me, and they put a lot of time and effort into those videos. Give them a little bit of love and let them know that Grandma sent you also. Oh my gosh, she is such an awesome channel and an awesome friend. Go give a little bit of love. The new to me can go up any Thursday, any time, and it can be anything that's new to you. It can be something that you bought. It could be something that someone bought for you. Or maybe something you found that's still new to you and share it with us. Sometimes you'd be amazed what people throw away. Well, let's go over and see what Grandma did this week. I've been over shopping again over at Dollar Tree, and I found some cute little things, and some of the things I bought a little ahead, only because I know when I'm wanting to look for them, they're no longer going to be in the store. So if you see something at Dollar Tree that you really, really love, might be good to buy it when you see it, because a lot of their stuff flies out the door, and you never see it again. Well... Sit down with your cup of tea or coffee and see what Grandma's going to share today and some new things that just came in this week. And don't forget, if you see them, pick them up. You won't see them next time you go. Now, I went and found these four little dolls. Well, I shouldn't say doll. These four little mermaids. I am going to try to do a project with them if it doesn't work out. I figure I can at least give them to the grand, great granddaughters to play with and they'll have fun. But let's just wait and see if Grandma can get this project to work. Grandma's always trying to do some kind of project. This is going to be a DIY project and Grandma is not that good at DIY so we'll have to wait and see if I can do something about it. But they're cute little dolls and they have a little comb and of course they have their cute little mermaid tails and they're all different colors and cute little dresses all different colors also i thought they were as cute as can be and that was four dollars and will be five dollars all together for four that isn't a bad price and i can see if the, the project works out if not great grandchildren girls will love having some dolls also, I got a few other dolls. They are super, super cute. And um, if they aren't going to work out for my project, they'll work out for the great granddaughters. Like I said, I have three of them. And they will each get a chance to pick one of these wonderful little dolls. Aren't they cute? I love how they're dressed, their hair, and they all look so precious and cute. Let me know which one was your favorite. These do look like better quality dolls than my mermaids. So, more than likely, I probably am going, not going to be using them in the DIY project. I will probably give these to the little great granddaughters to have something to play with. I know they will love having some new dolls. You know how small children are. Any, it doesn't have to be expensive. Just give them something new. They are so excited. Well, let me know which one of the dolls that you like better, these little dolls here or the mermaids. And don't forget, DIY projects are coming up for April. One more little doll for the dollhouse. This also came with a bed, a dresser, and a nightstand. I thought it was pretty nice for a dollar and a quarter, and I got four pieces. That's barely a quarter a piece. A little over what would that be a dollar no it would be 30 cents a piece God, it looks pretty good I'm sure the kids are gonna love having these new toys to play with like I said before small children don't need something big and fancy they're happy with whatever there is new it's new to them 
Now I know these are out a little bit early, but I thought I might as well go ahead and buy them now. Because if I wait until May or the 4th of July, I may not be able to find these wonderful red, white, and blue pieces. I love the little welcome sign, the blue truck in the American flag flying out the back. I love this beautiful wind spiral and as you can see it has a little star and it has my gnomes in it and it's going to have this red white and blue also this looks super super cute and i can't wait to put it out in the garden here's another one more for right now because it has uh well i guess i shouldn't say that i guess it does have the little flags this is america in the little flags in the bicycle and then the little American flag at the end. I, I love both of them. I did get a couple more things that are patriotic to put in the garden because they had them. I might wait and then find out I can't find them. So I went ahead and bought them probably a month or two too early. And of course the garden really doesn't look all that pretty because it's been so cold. But we'll see what we can do. You know how Grandma is always trying to get something pretty in the garden. 